He's tough. He'll throw himself through a wall um, for a, a stunt. We dumped him in the ocean. We dumped him in goo. He's underwater. He's jumping off rocks. We're hitting him with swords. He's on wires every five minutes. I don't understand how he does it, and he doesn't complain. Tomorrow. It's running through the entire set with sandals. We need more glass. Yeah, yeah. Cut glass. Yeah. We live in a world where Bourne and Dark Knight changed the game. The Bourne is a lot of Matt Damon doing his own stunts. So for us guys who are growing up watching these movies, you think you owe it in a way to the audience that you're not dropping out. That means put me on an ascender and I'll fall down however many flights and I'll do it. It's kind of cool fun, to be honest. What surprised me is the amount of physicality this man can do. He's better than a stuntman. He'll say, ah, give me the sword. Ah, ah. This man, you can actually put him into the action, and we haven't got to shoot around him. We've got him there, so you've got so much more choice of how you shoot it. Hang on, my fault. I thought it would be quite easy. I thought you could be like a five-year-old and just pick it up and kind of bounce away. But there's a whole different kind of set of rules when you're fighting with a shield and a sword. There's a skill to it. There's a skill you acquire, and there are tricks. Oh, oh, crap, man. Oh, man. Get your ass kicked. And to give Sam his due, he's so skilled at it, but he doesn't make you feel like you're an idiot because you can't do that. <laughs> he adapts what he's doing in order to make it look as good as it can possibly look. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Ah! Hang on, we'll start again. You knew that that was going. It was cool. Both fights I'm really proud of. It's great. Good, good, good. That was really good, guys. You're just <laughs> good. All right, good. Check the gate, please. Action! Sword. And Sam! Well, that was a dumb idea that I had. Um, I thought it would be kind of cool. I didn't realize that coming out of a scorpion, there would be a bucket load of goo on you. <laughs> Only a little, you said. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, ah! As Louis said, well, what do you think they've got inside them? Here we go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you know, I thought it was going to just look cool and real, real clean. Instead, you're spending the day covered in muck. Hey, Sam! No! Sam! No! Looks cool. <laughs> the idea was there. He said, forget that you got to do it. Oh, oh yeah! That was cool. It comes out. Yeah. 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 And horses. And he had to do a stunt where the horse rears up and then comes back down, and Sam was on the ground. You never know what the horse is going to do, you know, it's a beast. Oh, and he knows it looks better. He knows that doing a split screen, you know, it won't look good. He wants to be part of it. You all right, Sam? All right. Ready, boys? Steady? Ready. Yeah, I think it's an agreement to uh, focus in at the moment, not only as uh, characters, but as an actor and a horse. <laughs> yeah. We suck it up and do what we're doing, and then he can go back to his trailer, and I can go back to mine. <laughs> Yeah, it is a major deal to do that, but it sounds like, yeah, I'll do that, yeah, yeah. Why would we use the double? So, yes, it's, uh, it's great. Rolling, pick up, shooting, crane, and action! They said, can you jump off something and we can stop it by the time you hit the deck? 
And I said, well, if you don't, we're going to get one good take. That's about it. <laughs> it's the first year's jumping off the Pegasus and diving after the hoppy that has stolen his back. So, so it's a big high fall from the top of the stage. He doesn't believe I will do it. He thinks I'll wimp out and I'll have to face replace me and just put it on Adam's body. We'll have him up on what we call a descender rig. Where's your money, Sam? My money's safe. We'll release him and he'll plummet down. You're going to be worried about your money, my friend. Right. I think it's great that he's getting up there and doing it himself. It's, that's what makes me laugh, because it's a stuntman's job, falling on a descender. That's that's cool. Cool. Yeah, that's like... So we'll take you up a couple of feet, and then we'll just no. steady, steady you, yeah, yeah, Sam. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then when you're happy, when okay, you go we'll take you straight, straight to, the top, to the top and do it, it as top, is. Yeah. And we'll do it as is put yourself on the harness and you put yourself through it. And I think audiences demand that nowadays. And you want like a, like this. I just don't want the Superman. No, 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 I agree. Yeah. One minute you're static, we release you and you're just going flat out. And then you think you're gonna hit the ground and we stop you. <laughs> but the moment of, oh, I'm falling to my death, I am gonna die, no I'm not. <laughs> All in like the space of three seconds, it's a ride. So you and just a big kind of ah. Go. Let's go. Go. So we blew. We've already used that what a hundred times. Let's do one last one. Three, two, one, go. Good, right now. Good, that's hot. We're beating the heck out of him. Listen, the guy just did Avatar and Terminator. And only last week did he finally tell his agent, okay, I, I give up, I need a rest. This movie's beating the crap out of me. And I'm proud of that. <laughs> let's go again, let's go again. One more pizza. One more quickly. Reset quickly. Let's do one last one. Physical pain for him is just, it's, it's momentary. And what's important is what you get at the end of the day. Come on, nuts. Oh. That to me is, you know, that's the fun. And if it's fun for us doing it, hopefully, the audience, you know, sees that and has a good time as well. That's great. Good, good, good. That was really good.